a part of the Onto Browse package for controlled vocabularies in R. Now let's run Onto Browse and let's um, choose one show terminologies. So in uh, our database we have three terminologies and I'll choose Terminologia Histologica. We'll enter the term ID and let's choose to load all the available languages. Um, T is for the Terminologia Histologica ID, the, the, the official ID. Those uh, numbers beginning with H and um, following with digits. And we have English, Latin and uh, my Romanian sample. It's not an official sample. It's something that I've been working on. And we are um, waiting for the data to load. Okay, now um, it wants us to give a preferred language for display, for the terms display. Let's give Latin. So I'll show you how to browse data in the system. Now it automatically starts with the root, Terminologia Histologica, and it gives it in all the available languages. And uh, because it's the root, we don't have um, its parents. But it tells us that it has three children and no siblings. Um, we have the choices to enter a term ID, to go back, or to search for a term. Let's give it a term ID. Okay. So this is uh, the term cytology. Uh, the ancestry, now it has ancestry and it has one single parent. It has children and it has siblings. Let's search for a term. So, something like cytosol, for example. And it gives us um, a couple of options here. Um, let's choose a term ID. And uh, we can see that we have a bigger ancestry, no children, some siblings. Um, let's search for something like, for example, so we have um, two entities named like this, and if they actually are two different entities, that's why they have different IDs. One of them is, um, is under the, the cerebellum. Okay, and the other one is under the cerebrum. Okay. This was the browse function from the onto browse user interface. 